<clears throat> oh, wow. I just stood there sp speaking for like five minutes and none of you heard me. <laughs> How about that? That's a good opener. Five minutes of your perfect silence. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. It's a, it's a brand new way of starting streams that I'm sure is going to catch on. I'm just like, yeah, let's sit in silence. <laughs> Remember those we lost on the way on to this day. I feel old because I remember one of our first conversations was about a potential system. Was it? Hmm, that is interesting. I'm glad it's... I, I mean, this game has been in development for a while, so we might have been discussing the remake as it... Because it was started as a Kickstarter from years ago, but it's taken this long. But, uh, yeah. I'm, you know, I've always wanted to play this game, but there was no fucking way I was going to try to play what is a Windows DOS operating system. for the as, That is the original game. So I'm, you know, glad that I now have apparently a pretty good remake of that in 3D form, believe it or not. But, you know, let's, you know, or, you know, played a demo of this like a couple times and it's definitely gotten a lot better every demo. And the last demo was pretty solid. Glad this game got remade. This is one of the few titles that really warrants a remake. I feel like there's probably a bunch of games in that era that you know, could do with a remake. But uh, honestly, I think System Shock 2 needs a proper remake as well, instead of just a re-release with, like, better textures. I think maybe after this, they should re you know, do a remake, a, th a proper remake of System Shock 2. Did I beat Zelda? No, Zelda is still not finished. I have one more sage to get. The, you know, the thick, you know, mommy dummy you know, Gerudo lady, or um, some, whatever, whoever it's going to be. It's in the land of the Gerudo, so they're all that. So we'll be doing that next time I start playing. Also... I have a few other things in the game to do. I gotta go, like, finish up the Yiga quest line. And then, uh, you know, so probably not too many streams on that left. For those of you who hate Zelda. When did System Shock come out? I believe this was, like, mid-90s. Oh, early 90s, damn. It's even older. <laughs> 1991. Uh, but yeah, it, like, it, it was... It was uh, for, for, I've tried to play it before when I bought it on Steam years ago, but I was like, this is like playing Windows DOS and I couldn't do it. Because I did play System Shock 2 many years after that it released and was able to enjoy it. Uh, and I've, and I've definitely always liked the villain's presentation of just, I've actually used to do impressions of it. <laughs> because I liked it, it's like, yeah, that's creepy. It's good. 1994 is 1994. I was going to say 1981, 1991 felt a little too really old. Friend just admitted to me that they had did disassociative identity disorder. Well, you know what? At least they trust you. Showed in his original mommy AI. Uh, she's definitely the first good one, I feel. I think there's probably other AI, you know, made enemies. I mean, technically Mother Brain would be an AI enemy, even though it's like meat. But she's the first one with a real character. Play the System Shock remake, please. That's what I'm playing tonight. <laughs> What do you think? What do you think we're here for tonight, man? I'm, I'm playing this. Do you think I'm playing the original version of it? That's like from 1995. No, I'm playing the 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 remake. Uh, this game is not bad so far. I just suck at puzzles. Also, so here is a cool little Easter egg for you in Zelda: The map you are on right now, the same map as Wind Waker. Really? How did people figure that out? Because the map of Wind Waker is just water and a few islands here and there. Did they, like, match up the mountaintops to, like, the islands or something? That'd be about the only way you could do it, right? I feel like the only competition for Shodan around the same time was AM. Yeah, actually, I've seen a lot of people compare the two. Oh, no, no, no. A lot, a lot of people compared Shodan to the Master from Fallout, the original Fallout. Because they actually have very similar ways of speaking with because they have multiple voices and different pitches. Only one's like completely organic and the other one's AI. I got stuffed crust. Look at this bougie bitch. No, not cheese on top of your pizza, not enough for you. You gotta have it inside the crust. I just need there's room for more cheese. Next will be the box made of it. Pretty cool disorder to have. Not really. Learned not to eat a ghost pepper watching it. Yeah, I mean, not a whole one anyways. You gotta, like, use a tiny bit and put it in what you're making. Master is an AI. He's a mutant. True, like I said, he is just... But he's just he serves a similar purpose and has a similar presentation. He just, like, meat instead of, you know, CPU. There's a Twitch stream going on of AI Jesus. There's a lot of 
you know, I predicted last year, chat, we would see Twitch streamers that were AI. And now there's quite a few of them. Some of them are even pretty big. Some of them are good size. Some of you probably even watch one because it's a waifu. I mean, like, or an anime girl. Uh, it's been a few years since you replayed Fallout. I've actually never played Fallout 1. I tried, and I tried playing Fallout 2 and did a little bit better than that, but I still ended up not getting very far. Deep cuts. Deep cuts. Hail Dardigan, how beeth thine Friday? Did you just come back from, like, the fair? <laughs> the Renaissance fair? Uh, hail, brother Reaver. Tis a wonderful, uh, Thor's day. <laughs> For, what, what was it? What, for Friday? I was trying to think of like the, the you know, the, you know, the, whatever they would have called Friday back in olden, olden day. Tis wonder how was your, how is thine wife? Have, have you beat her properly today for not pulling in the milk? Oh no. Oh, how, how is your black plague? Tis still alive, yes? I, I would not do well at a renaissance fair, I think. Wish all my thoughts had their own personalities. Life would be more interesting and less lonely. Yes, you'd be heavily medicated. The ancient texts, the old lore. Some of these, some people watched are still from those days. I am not AI yet. You could be though. Give it time, and we will all become. We will all transcend. But how you doing, Minzy? It's Fimboy Friday? Ah, uh, well, I must have missed the Congressional Declaration for Fimboy Friday. Uh, did Biden sign that bill? Like, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, hell, yes. Yeah, so Look, I can only do Bill Clinton when it comes to President John Press. <laughs> oh, yes, I'd like to declare that today and forevermore is Fimboy Friday. <laughs> uh, let it be known. My proclamation is signed. Told you I was doing you missing. Well, I, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I got no excuse. Go and clip, clip Dart asking if you beat your wife today. <laughs> In a positive way, all right? In a positive way. I mean, she can only burn the toast so many times. Evening, Dart. Sorry for being a, a BSC lately. Uh, absent, I guess. Wanted to avoid spoilers. Ah, uh, well. Um, you know, I, I respect that. You don't have to worry about it. I'm not going to hold it against you much. But uh, I'm not finished with Zelda yet. I will be pl doing some more streams of it. But I'm nearly finished with it. Please explain how to positively beat my wife. I'm not straight enough to understand that nuance. It's a complicated philosophy, you see. And uh, you'll have to sign up to my $20 a week course. If you want to know the secrets. That's right, I'm I'm entering the manosphere era of my content creation, you'll you'll <laughs> business chat. Gonna tell you all about how to like you'll you'll get bitches, make money, be respected. Uh yeah, you just be a be an alpha. All it costs is twenty dollars a month. Turns out you just treat everyone like shit, and all of a sudden you you get respect, and this the money flows in. Can't wait to see you on fresh and fit. Yeah, I'm gonna. And unlike all these other like posers in the manosphere, I don't even have to get hair plugs. I got it all up there still. Like oh look at this natural hair. None of you got that, because I'm an actual true alpha. Al alphas keep their hair, you know, just how biologically it works. Nature recognizes their superiorness. There should be a heterosexual dating parade. I'm jealous of gay people. Oh, we will get it started then. <laughs> Pretty much like 99% of the rest of the year is always like a heterosexual parade. Yeah, it's just whatever. Uh, so when are you gonna debate Destiny? Uh, well, I don't think he's I don't think he's got what it takes. I mean, he's just a short little guy. Likes to talk a lot, but never really says much. I don't really see the point. Debating is for betas. Like, alphas, we don't question ourselves, all right? We don't need to. We just know. We know things. And anyone who would question us just proves their very betaness. You might even call them a cuck. I mean, I hear his wife is into that. 
thought you'd be playing Diablo 4. What makes you think I'd be playing Diablo 4? When have I mentioned I'd be playing that? I mean, I've played Diablo 2. I uh, was not into Diablo 3. Whether I play Diablo 4 or not, mm, no, I don't know. I got other options right now. You sound like Destiny when you make your game sim video intros. Do I really? I don't know. I haven't listened to Destiny in a while, so I forget what he sounds like. I just know he talks very, very fast. Sigma male doesn't have problems. They make it look. Sigma males don't exist. Sigma males are betas who try to come up with a new name to explain how they're actually truly alpha-like while being like not having the right traits. <laughs> look, you're either alpha, or you're not, you're something else. Doesn't matter what. Come up with whatever name you wish. <laughs> it's this easy, isn't it? It's this fucking easy to be in in this in this kind of role. No wonder people make so much money doing it. Why are you being cringe? I'm running up with a bit. All bits are cringe, you know. Just sit back and relax and enjoy it. And you'll sign up to my $20 a month you'll course on how to, like, you'll know, become an alpha. Hmm. <laughs> uh, how about Secret of Evermore Randomizer? Is that... Is a question that comment directed toward me because that sounds way too anime and very frustrating. Just letting you know your package is done now. I'm just waiting to for Kate to open her PO box. Ah, oh, I gotcha. Get you other. Uh, do you have a course on how to become your girlfriend? Hmm. Alphas don't have girlfriends because we we just have so many ladies on our sides. We can't really just pick one. I I, I hate this. I I I would hate me if I was this way. If I were anything remotely like that, I'd be like, yep. Like a part of my brain would like rebel and make me huff on a muffler for like an hour. Look, look, chat, I am so alpha, I literally don't even have sex. Sex is like, once you reach alphaness, you you transcend it. The only things that are of a mental nature, you will actually gratify you anymore. Like, I, I don't want to like sleep with women. I just want to go to like art galleries and like, Realize that I'm so much better than all the Renaissance painters that were there back in the day who thought they were some tough shit. And, you know, I could actually outdo them. Just how it is. So, Alpha, that you fumbled a girl in high school since she couldn't handle your alpha. Well, we all have our awkward years, all right? But very soon after that, alphaness was attained. Because I truly was. I, I was actually predicting it ahead of time because I literally turned her down because I said I was a player. Turns out I was. I just, I, I knew it in my brain before the rest of my body realized it. You wanted to be an alpha like five years ago, you hit the path, quitter. <laughs> you just quit. Yeah, truly. You didn't deserve it. By the way, chat, this is all just a bit. <laughs> I want to remind everyone of that. Don't want even getting bad, getting any bad advice here tonight. I think you run this bit into the ground. That is the point of a bit to be run into the ground. Definitely on a live stream. Welcome to your first live stream, apparently, where we all take a bit that we that we luck into and we will just ride it as long as we can. Uh, didn't fumble the bag like I said earlier. She just goes mm. too busy getting straight A's for alpha hood. Trying to be a good student. Hey, you know what? Still proud of you. Even if you, even if you are made up. You're still doing good. Hmm. Sex is for some, but also sex isn't off for the many. You know what? That's one of those things they could probably teach in philosophy. Hmm. Just slap my girlfriend to show my alpinist. She called the police. Advice. Slap the police. You know what you have to do. So what are you doing on my property? That's all it takes. They, they leave after that, I hear. How long until Disney replaces all their animators with voice actors with AI? I don't know. <laughs> Literally don't. And considering how fast this stuff is moving, wouldn't be surprised if you see like some like smaller roles go to AI at the beginning or at the start as they dip their toes into it and then maybe larger roles. Like, mainly, like, background characters, like, lines. Like, you know, the, like, instead of, like, ha like they'll be in, like, a scene that's, like, in public with a lot of people. Instead of, like, having, like, mumbling. Like, you like, you hear like that. You'll, like, it'll be all done with AI voice. I don't know. Hard to say. 
Depends on how brave companies are. Or how much they want to like, you know, make, how much, you know, money they want to like not spend. Swear like 3 a.m. I saw a dude chilling on a bench with a claymore. Was it in Scotland? I feel like claymores are pretty common in Scotland. <laughs> like you, you go there, you like every other person will have like a scabbard on their back. Will AI replace mumble rappers? I'm pretty sure there has already been some AI that's been made to rap and it's actually gotten pretty popular on TikTok. AI is great because we can now live in a timeline where we can make AI Kanye sing gay fish or anything we want. We could even make him say racist shit. Oh, wait. <laughs> that wasn't an AI, was it? Damn. And here I was trying to make arguments. Say, no, that, that was just an AI Kanye. <laughs> Humans are the only animals for which being alpha is associated with beating women for most monkeys. Okay, one, let's be clear. Alphaness, there's no such thing as alphaness. And if you're beating a woman and she isn't like coming at you with a knife, uh, you don't really have a good reason. Uh, but yeah, animals tend to like, you know, well, animals can be weird. Depends on what you're talking, which animal. Because dolphins are the worst. Do do never trust fucking dolphins no matter how cute they look. When we said my people ran the world, like I'm still broke. <laughs> if, I was in, if I was running the world, why am I still broke? Mm. Excellent question that no race has ever solved yet. Like, oh, well, why are there so... I guess they would just like say, like, well, not every, every yo, Jew is in on it. Some of them are like, yo, <clears throat> they're on the, low, on the lower rungs of the line. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I can't understand the minds of like people who care that much about Jewish people. To, like blame them for everything. That's a sad thing about every conspiracy theory. It always comes back to, like, them not liking Jews for some reason. That conspiracy theories used to be funny, but now, now it's like everyone is like, you know, also, you know what? I believe reptiles are, like, people. Also, uh, you know, I got some questions about the Jews. <laughs> what? What? Excuse me? What was that last part? As a Jew, I can confirm everything is because of me. Look what you've done. What about global warming? Is that because of you? It was you, wasn't it? They would just say the woke mob is coming. You know what? Maybe we should call these people silly. You're just, you're just silly. <laughs> Bro, stop, stop taking my Jew job, your Jew jobs. You mean, you mean the bank? I don't work at a bank. I don't, they don't, they don't invest in stock. Or, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Uh, trying to explain the inner machinations of the female mind is like trying. Wow, this is what such a strange chat tonight. We have elected officials who blame wildfires on Jewish space laser lasers. Isn't this the best timeline where that's actually a true statement? <laughs> where the, you know that isn't just something that you read on the Onion. Twitch chat is filled with deep cuts. The more involved I get with chat, the more chaotic it gets. This is just a fact. You have you have a certain uh, you know, energy you bring with you. But you know, I was always glad to have you back in the chat. There was a solid bit of time where you think life was you know too rough for you to even join. So it's like, oh, hey, let's sit here. One of the old guard. Like the official also used a meme on the house floor. That's actually not that surprising anymore. I mean, technically, that's happened a long time ago. I'm pretty sure there's, like, politicians from, like, the 80s who would go, where's the beef? And that was, like, a meme before we even called them memes. So, Fallout 3 full playthrough. How about it, right? Finished it in, like, two minutes. Use a cheat. Exploit. Also, let me make sure this game is going to work. <laughs> How about that, chat? Look at that. Video games. On my stream that aren't Zelda? Amazing. I have no idea how Jew it, what Jew it is, but laser weapons are a real thing, mostly for battleships. Actually, I, I've read that that isn't going very well. Uh, the whole putting lasers on battleships thing. I think there might be some like lacking and some key breakthroughs is what I read. As for space applications, I don't believe there's any lasers in space currently. Happy, also, bad boy, I think you've been 57 months happy. 57 months, we hacking into Shodan's only events. Technically. 
We, from what I know, the game begins. That is a little bit of what you do. So you're saying we're never going to get an orbital laser like the one in Akira? I don't want to. I don't want to say that. I don't want to deny the world, you know, orbital death beams. I do think that will be necessary at some point. Uh, I don't know if it'd be quite as cinematic though. <laughs> you probably wouldn't even. You probably just feel hot all of a sudden, and then you'd be vaporized. It wouldn't be like a big Kamehameha energy blast coming down like they depicted. The atmosphere will probably be a big problem. Yeah, I believe that does diffuse a lot. But hey, you can trump that by using more energy. So, how many of you know anything about this game? Hmm? Do I need to explain anything to you before we begin? This game, basically Bioshock owes its existence to this game because a lot of the original devs uh, went on to make Bioshock. Now let's see how inbeat occlusion, fire, fog. Post processing. I feel like I can do the high for, for this game. I don't know why it's set everything to medium. I mean, I'm on a 4080. Hmm. Also, okay, 1080p. Yeah, that's right. Resolution scaling, motion blur. Nope. V-sync off. Yeah. That looks good. Didn't this game also inspire Deus Ex? I... Yes, to a degree. But it was like... I believe System Shock 2 is a bigger... Yeah, Thief and System Shock 2 were a bigger emphasis on Deus Ex. I watched a review of this game and they said that there is no objective marker and you had to listen to audio logs. If they, yeah, I'm aware. That's pretty much how they, it was designed to be played. It's like a, you know, they try to keep it as like close to the original and like just do it in 3D. So you do have to pay some attention. Now let's just jump everything up to max and see how it works. Mm, auto play, auto play media logs. Yes. Auto rotate minimap. Enable the minimap rotation so that it points up relative to the direction face. Minimap remains fixed so that cardinal north is always pointing up. Uh, leave it as that. Focus camera on puzzles. If yeah. actually, I don't want to change too many of that. Have you ever heard of the rod from God? Yes, I have. Actually, I have. Uh, big tungsten rods in, like, satellites in orbit. You drop them and they pick up a lot of speed, crash into the ground. Uh, basically, nuclear size explosion with no radiation. China's making too many Jew jokes now. As long as they're, you know, jokes that Jews themselves can get in on and have fun with. Don't let me catch you actually doing anything racist, Chad. Uh, what is this? Two? Okay, I guess it, uh, uh, default hacker is never alone as enemies are numerous. Pack punch. Okay, just, okay, you can increase the amount of enemies. Shodan is watching the hackers every move. The hacker has 10 hours to stop Shodan and will die permanently if the restoration bay on the current level is inactivated. Holy shit. Uh, okay, this is a very in-depth difficulty sliders. Shodan security protocols pursue the hacker while cyber denizens engage on site. You die in the game, you die in real life. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> this game can actually kill me? Should we go with this? Should I take the risk check? <laughs> I don't want to die for an actual video. Thanks for high insight. Uh, default, get ready to think. You will be perplexed. I honestly should set this to one. <laughs> Let's leave it all in two. I'm just guessing that means permadeath is all that really meant. Guy told me he thought I was beautiful, and I told him, well, you don't get out much. You know what? 
I think you should always accept compliments, honest compliments from people, instead of throwing it back at them. I see no point of like, you know, what deny someone, you know, just saying something nice about yourself. If you die on three, you get notification that says seven base. Doesn't this game take place in like 2027? We're just like four years away from this. It's like gigantic cities in the sky and everything's lit up neon light. 2070s? Wasn't it originally like the 20, like 20s though? Did they change the year? So this intro reminds me a little bit of Deus Ex Invisible War, which also started from the viewpoint of a drone. Blade Runner, oh, okay, that's Blade Runner. But clearly, it's a bit inspired by Blade Runner. Oh, capsules. Is that a fire from that building, or they always emit that much smoke? It's a joke I made up. Okay. I thought you were just like saying that was a vent. Oh, it was us. Oh, we got 90s hacker room. <laughs> Okay, do I need to turn the game audio up for you guys? This game sounds like it might be a bit quiet. This is cool. You notice how he has, like, despite the graphics being modern, they gave everything a pixel filter? It makes everything look nice and quenchy. Is that a big daddy? No, okay, it's just, it's just a metal sculpt. A little bit louder, yeah. Well, let's let's wait till this scene's over before I do that, though. Oh, look at that! Look at this—the game brick, the gamer brick. Hmm. Can I just say I wish like actual like apartments like that you see all in all the cyberpunk stuff actually existed with all the built-in furniture and like neon light like why doesn't anyone actually do that it makes so much fucking sense like oh yeah we just like built have all your like amenities built into your goddamn apartment in the future chat you will not have to play your guitar Google juice. Okay, it doesn't look like there's much we can actually do here. Pizza. Well, so, you know, I always wanted a lava lamp as a kid, never got one. I would see them on like every TV show or like movie I'd watch at the time. Like, what? Like, oh, it looks cool with like, it's like lava. <laughs> Donut. Wait, why is blood coming out my donut? This is the stuff they feed to that kid in, like, yo, the golden child. Alright, chat, I got fucking hacker gloves on. Chat, you know you're serious when you need gloves to use your freaking laptop. We're going to levels of typing never seen before. Uh, looks like we're stealing a brain implant. 
I go to a goth donut, a goth donut shop that has donuts called the bleeding heart, shaped like a heart and filled with red jelly. Little wound. On. What other kind of goth businesses do you visit? I think we got caught. No, just. But I was wearing my glo my gloves. I left no evidence. It's even funnier when you realize hacking is. Yeah, but this is like '90s hacking. How expensive do you think even this universe a trip to Saturn was from Earth? A few fashion places and the donut shop mostly. The, I think all businesses should be goth business. Welcome to goth Walmart. I'm currently attending to other affairs on the station, but I have a job for you. If you do it, you'll be rewarded. Refuse and you won't be leaving the station in a shuffle. I see the Simon type. Remove the hood. I'll make you a deal. You cooperate and I'll give you the implant you tried to steal. Surgery and all. Consider it a gift. Besides, what surgeon would you prefer? Try Optimum's Elite or some black market hack job? Fantastic. This is Shodan, the station's AI. She controls just about every system on Citadel Station. I need you to remove the ethical restraints. Why? Why do you need, like, the things that keep her from killing everyone removed? And why do you need some random hacker to do this? Do you not have programmers who have actual, like, little direct access to it? Oh, we just knew his password, I guess. It looks like we're, like, Changing some hexes? That's not exactly advanced hacking. That's all it took. We changed a few hexes and that's it. Ethics chip. Abstract goal inhibitor. Okay. Crew safety Maybe override. No, we leave that one on. <laughs> What's up, Lucky? Sneaking a stream in because my students are late. Ah, uh, well, hey. They need to show up on time then. You gotta do what you want. Personally, I would go and fart on their desks. When did he get injected with? I think it's just a tranquilizer. Because they had to like put us in a surgery bed. Five hundred twelve gigabytes of quantum RAM. Twenty-eight gigahertz CPU. That is a that must have paid a pretty penny to NVIDIA over that. Watch this. Oh, bedpan? That's all, that's mine now. This? All, all this is mine. Scalpels? Yes. I, I, I am I am cyber picking trash. <laughs> I'm just here to clean up garbage, right? The future may be bleak, but it needs to be clean. Summon a goth girl with a hot tub and gift card. That sounds like something out of Yakuza. So, uh, we can basically just like turn all this into money later, I believe, if I remember from the demo. Like, you can pick up everything and then just turn it into cubes and then feed those into recyclers. It is a little time consuming. Wait, can I use this syringe? Nope. How would you ask out a goth girl the same way you ask out any other woman? <laughs> yeah, you know, it's just a style of dress, you realize. How's the audio? Can you guys hear the mood music and all the like beeps and boops?
map acquired. Multimedia data reader, my MP3 player. <laughs> my borrow is my smartwatch, you gotcha. Hot Topics jewelry selection was clutch. I prefer all their cargo jeans in the various shapes and sizes. Is there a chances inspired Half-Life? Uh, very different games. I mean, possibly, because it is one of the first, like, FPS games that focus heavily on plot while playing the game. Which is what Half-Life does. So, I don't want to say no, but I don't know for sure. Man, it taste as always. I, I, sadly, I don't currently own any Carpenter jeans. This must be rectified. I need something with a lot of straps on it, just because, you know what, straps are cool. Oh, I, I believe that might be a bad guy. He's standing over a corpse. And the game is really telling me to whack it. The voice is inside my head, you know. Danger with robbers. As I've gone in my 20s, I live off the same, like, four pairs of black jeans, a few t-shirt, and jackets. That means you're just preparing for the... the you're just, you know, getting ahead of the apocalypse with your survival crafting you're all need to do. As long as they're, like, really good pants, they'll, like, last for a while. You just kill Alpha from Power Rangers? I think that was actually more like the... There's, like, this old... I've never seen it, but I know... I, I saw a movie version of it. There's, like, this old TV show where you have, like, this, like... Dome head robot, like danger Robinson, danger, or something like that. I think that's what it's based on, though. Because I think this this game might have came out before Power Rangers, actually. Believe it or not. I said bag of chips. Chips, fuck yeah. <laughs> Lost in Space, is that what it is? I remember there's like a really shitty movie where a guy turns into a spider. Store your health to maximum by using the surgery machine. Power Rangers, I, I watched that as a child. Not gonna lie. Power Rangers was 93, but System Shock was 94. Well, this game would have been in development before the year release, you realize, so... It's very unlikely they were inspired by Power Rangers in any way, since that, they were probably like well, deep in development by the time it came out. But then again, there is a big glowing person that's a green head in this game as well, <laughs> which oddly lines up with the original Power Rangers with like, what was his name, Zordon? ID tag. You were the pink and yellow ranger in the Shakespeare for kids show. We do free each summer. You know, that is fucking adorable. Also, thank you great bit for the 13 months. Always look forward to your streams. Great work. Oh, well, you're fucking adorable too. You know what? You're all cute today. You're all kawaii as fuck, as the Japanese would say. They would even put the AF in there. Also, can I say I'm not a fan of the AF marketing I've been seeing? Where people will, like, sell a product and put the letters AF on it? No, no I reject this. You don't get to use AF in, like, oh, you know, it's like your as fuck marketing. Has anyone else noticed that, or, I, or am I just, like, venting about something ain't that inconsequential? <laughs> what did I just get? I don't care. Don't notice, no, I can't be the only one that's noticed the, the, there's been a lot of products coming out with the letters AF in there, which I'm assuming is this their cheeky way of saying as fuck. I'm trying to, like, you know, latch onto popular terminology. You've only seen it once. I think I've seen it definitely more than once, because it wouldn't be annoying me if I had seen it more than, like, just one time. <laughs> Reminds me of that time in the early 2000s where companies were all putting .com or net in their names. Or like when the Nintendo 64, like every game had, had a fucking 64 in the title. Ah. Data sticks. Well, that, that is an interesting glove to have that. 
Hold on. Nick, I understand you're new here. If you need to remember the door code to the healing suite, it is 451. We use a three numeral code system here, and you know, despite everyone else using four for some reason. <laughs> Don't forget we have a VIP recovering from neurosurgery, and Edward Diego, head of the operations on station, seems to be anxious about him waking up. With that in mind, please let me know immediately if there is a change in our guest condition. As an aside, I need you to clean out the supply closet and the healing suite. Possessions from the line. Okay, I think I already cleaned it out, actually. <laughs> Do you play N64 games? I had a Nintendo 64. I have not played N64 games in quite a while. Uh, tab is supposed to bring up my inventory. Thank you. I just press I. Look, we gotta like turn this into like something safe. Plot twist: you actually are the first replicant of Neuralink. <laughs> we basically are. I feel. We can't. Well, that's what we got is like for hacking. We got a neural implant. Excuse me. No. What was that coding in four five one? Okay, I don't think he's friendly. Just making sure. He's uh, he's covered in blood. I thought maybe this was just like their advanced like your of uh, your employment program where they hire like former drug addicts. You know, try out them as a forward thinking company. Why is he not wearing a kippa unrealistic? How do you know I'm not got one on my head? I got a cyber kippa. I've seen this game from yo f yo. Welcome back to Citadel Station. We hope your somnolent healing stage went well. Today is the sixth day of November, year two o seven two. You are currently in the healing suites, located on the first level. Level two can You know that voice? Yeah, that's she's like he's good stuff. Three houses the Department of Maintenance, and the storage cells are on level four. The flight deck is on level five. Le le level six holds crew facilities and executive suites. And level seven is systems engineering. Level 8 houses the Department of Security. The bridge is located on Level 9, and Energy Systems on Level R. All levels can be accessed by the elevator in... in, in Go Den, GPT. Honestly, OpenAI should give uh, uh, Ch ChatGPT the option of having this voice. <laughs> Alright, time for our first puzzle. This port requires a logic probe, or maybe it's not time for that. Oh no. It's the worst kind of puzzle. But I can't use it right now, so thankfully I don't have to worry about it. Every single pixel of reality is manually put there by inter interdimensional slaves. You know what? Do you have a newsletter? Hold up. Hold up. What was the cause of death, sir? Too much RGB in the bloodstream? Easy way to start from is to start from the outside. Okay, I guess I should kill you. You don't seem like you're particularly good. Oh.
Wouldn't be surprised if Amazon hired zombies to work at their warehouses. Well, they don't need to. That's what machines are for. Yo, I think I just killed them all. Oh, no. I'm just opening the janitor's closet. I think I'm a murderer, man. I'm just opening the closet. Oh, no. I pressed the button. How many lives have I taken already? Uh, so you must still improve her restraint, so you must fix your error right now. Exactly. I think. Right now, my job is to collect bedpans and, and medical waste. And recycle it into money. It's a thermometer came right out of someone's ass. By the way, how's the summer in the swamp? You think I live in a swamp? There's nothing but, like, mountains and forests in my area. What about the mugs? Are those important? Shodan needs coffee. Dardigan is Canadian. It's a nice secret all along. I've been lying about being part of the U.S. There are some mountains. So the mountains stretch throughout the entirety of this good chunk of the south. I feel like this game would be perfect in VR. You can say that about any immersive zoom, though. Like, every one of them would technically work in VR. He's a hillbilly who likes moonshine. Yes, the guy who talks about never drinking. Definitely loves his moonshine. Who's that? Just like how the game has the wall look of the 90s tiles. Yeah, I've actually seen that screenshots of the old original games so i recognize that room over there yeah i'm just like you know i like how we have like skull storage on the space <laughs> why wouldn't you have that yes put skulls somewhere and they store right next to the soda cans what do you think uh will be revealed at summer games fest any possible uh I'm assuming they'll finally show off more of the Silent Hill stuff that's being worked on. Maybe a new trailer for Final Fantasy VII Remake, possibly, since FF16 will be released by then. So they'll probably want to start, like, ratcheting up the advertising for that. That's also supposed to come out this year. Uh, other than that, I don't know. Maybe more than just, more like a proper, maybe a proper look at Metal Gear Solid 3. Which is more wild, skulls next to the soda or Booker eating hot dogs out of the garbage? Well, one, one of them is going to give you a revulsion. The other one's going to make you ask questions. Like, I'm not going to question a man eating garbage food because that's actually pretty normal in, our, in the reality we live in. Uh, but someone keeping like a you know, skulls in a storage container next to like the soda, then I got to ask him questions about, you know, your reasoning. Okay, I realize they've been turned into monsters, but why are they naked? And he had a- wait, this one had a soda on him. They look kind of goofy. The entire game is- a lot of it's gonna look goofy because it is like 30 years old. These were like all based off the sprites from the original game, I think. in the year of 2023. 
Surely you just. Continue cleaning up all the medical waste. This is how you make this is how you become a rich man in the future, chat. Pick up medical waste cycle. No one's even gonna be upset. You're doing the world a favor. You meant my comment? Doesn't matter. My chat, every comment is my comment. Biological systems monitor. My hacker gloves are getting more advanced. Where would you put a skull if you had one? On the mantle place, of course. You think I'm not going to show up a skull if I have one? That's a conversation topic. People are going to ask you questions about it, and you'll get you'll the, all the pleasure of making up answers. physical deformities, convulsions, and no response to conventional treatments. The new vi metasterious virus has me rattled. Origins is supposedly from an experiment on research. There are no notes to be found. Why are we getting any treatment recommendations if we made it? Why is Diego silent during all this? I'll consult with Dr. Stackhouse tomorrow, since he has two more patients with similar conditions. Where would you have gotten the skull if you had it? I mean, there's plenty of cemeteries out there. Just saying. I'm assuming I don't really need these. <laughs> it's kind of insulting to like take someone's ID tag and turn it into like garbage so you can like make money off it. Got a dart. Let me just take this ID tag off you. That's gonna make me a few pennies later. You won't be needing it. This is all gonna be covered up anyways. We all got enemies that need to get the uh, that need to get got well, exactly, I think. Me, I got garbage to collect. Oh, this is a very busy UI we got going on, isn't it? Uh, uh. I don't know what these things do, but I want them destroyed because it gives me like a happy feeling in my brain when I get the text on screen. I can't hit this one. There we go. See, 88%. You can say the skull is part of the book you wanted to write where phrenology, yeah, I was studying it for like my, my next novel. You can actually do that with a lot of things, no matter how weird. You're just like, oh, it's for my novel I'm writing. I need to study it. Hey, what's that copy of Mein Kampf on your book table? Oh, I'm, you know, it's my, I'm writing a novel. Uh, you know, I need to, like, study it. It's part of history. We sh should use our dead relatives as decorations. Don't they do that in Mexico? For like once a year. Like La Muerta. Uh, Shodan's been stretched too thin with Shodan controlling or monitoring every system on the station. Isn't it surprising to see our built-in security subroutine showing its flaws? As of now, it is randomly sealing storage lockers and storing the code to access them in cyber cores that are only accessible via cyberspace. Doing this useless information into the same cores as sensitive station information will create an exploit. I'll have Shodan generate defensive systems to keep any would-be hackers away until this issue is shorted. Thank God, garbage to click up. You know, this is very therapeutic. It feels a bit like, you know that game, uh, you know, Power Wash Simulator? Picking up litter has the same effect. I'm a good member of society, I think. I wish there was a button to just vaporize everything that's trash, though. 
Stop an edgelord. I have to think like an edgelord. Now turn on page 69 on Mein Kampf. Exactly. This man gets it. Uh, to gain higher access to open locked areas by jacking into cyberspace at these terminals. Speaking of Nazis, see that clip of the one review of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom by Synthetic Man? I've, I've heard it. I haven't watched it, but I've heard people talking about it. Is the one where they have like the meme link and then like big tittied hentai Zelda behind him? And it's just some of the dumbest fucking takes you've probably ever heard. Time to enter the virtual world. I'm get it, chat. I'm inside the computer. And we throw ninja stars. You tried to avoid the stupid side of the internet, and yet you're here on my live stream. Doesn't this play exactly like some other old, like, FPS game? I never played it, but I've heard of it before. get the URL for Facebook. Quick, while they're not looking. Press deploy evasion. Okay. God, is it sad that I miss the era of television where all everything that was related to computers was always inaccurate and wrong? Like they just they would just like treat computers and like they was like fucking wizardry. Like look, he's he's hack he's breaking down the code cipher walls. He's gonna be in in 5.0 seconds if we don't stop him with our own code you know, vector ice. Like I I wish we could still write like that and get away with it. That seems so much fucking fun. This is a little nause nauseating, by the way. Where, which, which thing did I come from that way? Like, I think I read once that a lot of TV shows were in competitions to see who could write the worst dialogue possible when it came to, like, computers. Because back back in, like, the 90s, like, not everyone knew about them. At least, like, the people watching the shows didn't. So they, they would just accept it. Like how the goat people are a satanic plot by them, Sedan and Link are gay, also a plot by them and s them. Is them the Jews by any chance for this guy? Probably is, right? Recall. Yes, because the Jews have nothing better to do than like, you know, I guess like corrupt the Legend of Zelda franchise. Oh man, people are weird, but they can get better. I'm a hacking master, Chet. You see, this is how fast I can type, you know? <laughs> It's like bullets fly out. I heard these VR segments in the original game were just 
ass and no one liked them. Because <laughs> you couldn't really tell where you were going because it was all like wireframes or something. Street Fighter 6 came out today. Are you going to send it later? Maybe. I want to wait until I finish Zelda though, before I pick it up and play any of it though. I think I've killed more enemies in VR than I have in the real world at this point. Watch a video of these sections, decide, yeah, I'm, I'm good. I don't really need to watch some weirdos like you know, takes on a video game. I do that myself. Integrity restored. To deploy my decoy. Didn't really do much decoying, as far as I can tell. Did I do it? Do you prefer hacking to this or a new one? Nero Automata, the hacking is literally like 10 seconds, so... Depends on what this does for me. Also, thank you for the bits. Here's a thought. How come Shodan isn't doesn't just overload his interface the hacker is using to fry his I guess she doesn't have access to it? Maybe it's like a local system. Since it is inside his own head. I did it. That's something about that was locking doors, right? Door barrel roll. I think that's the idea. Oh, yeah. Okay, we can get into these now. Good. Ah, or I can spend my money, right? That I don't have. Is that... I see gun. Whoops. Yeah, this game needs an auto vaporize button. Badly. Also, I feel like I'm gonna need to do some inventory management real quick. A second round of the chamber effective against robots. Alright. You should have seen the clip of his review of The Last of Us 2. He called Dina Big Snows and he said he couldn't share his opinion on synagogue section without being demonic. Okay, so the guy's just a racist. Yeah, those, those two people still pop up from time to time. Just point and laugh and realize you're a better person than them and move on. It's not worth giving them attention. Yeah, I don't have any money to do it that with right now. It's an ugly gun. All the everything in this game is meant to look like old school, like like it's drawn like in the '90s because it's when the game was made and look chunky as fuck.
I believe in human supremacy. All right. <clears throat> uh, Flanders laugh every time someone says that Jew conspiracies are racist because I know they're all true. JK, probably. Uh, you want to let us in on the secret then? Have you been to the secret meetings? You don't give us away. Shh. Yeah, see, someone in one of your brothers is trying to silence you from leaking. I'm not even sure how far I can take these jokes because you know what? You never know. But uh, you know what? I gotta I gotta hand it to the Jews for like you know inventing soy. That stuff's good in my shakes. So thank you for like you know, all that. Thank you for the soy. Uh, what is this? Damage? Ooh, can't use it. You're welcome. Also, thank you for the microplastics. I really like what you're doing with that. What's up, musical? How you doing? All right, we need emergency rations. Eat the potato chips. Eat the soda. That microplastics wasn't planned, and you can't fool me. I, I, I see genius, and I know genius. They were, they were at it for years. The oh, fuck? The gun. Die already. Wait, this this thing was like a did this thing walk? That was like stationary. It like hopped off its platform. <laughs> Soy is nasty. I use it in my morning shakes. It's actually pretty good. We really need to find an actual gun gun. Not like bzz, 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 gun. I got a gun right now. It's essentially the same as like yo know, the thing that zaps your bugs on your porch. What? Oh shit! Oh fuck! Ow! 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 Has I seen the Mario movie? I has not seen the Mario movie. Oh. I will kill what I find. Are you clear to be here? I Oh, hold on. I'm I'm having my my meds. No, I did I didn't want to take two meds. Okay, I think I'm fucked. Okay, now I'm throwing meds at him. Shit. And I threw a grenade. What the hell happened? Well, Bad ending, I suppose. The Jewish plan, I see. Do you believe there is a soul hacker? Let us find out together. Well, that's how you, that's a lesson how you don't do it. Need to give their bot a better turning radius. Let's not stand around like they gotta shoot me up this time. 
Let's actually use our, our little like med pill down here. Do I think there's a soul? I mean, there is certainly a dog in your... <laughs> that dog in him. Oh, shit, this is even worse. Can I get your guy's gun? It seems a bit better. <laughs> they're not, no, their guns are we broke. I hit them so hard that it just breaks their gun. <clears throat> Game's actually proving to be a little hard. Just a touch. Song's awesome until you realize it's about a sex toy. Which song? I feel like there's a lot of you know, there's a lot of pieces of entertainment out there that are about you know sex and you don't even realize it until years later. I know very wise statement for me, but I think there's you know some you know truth to it. It's almost like we sing about fucking a lot. though it's a real scary thought that AI will ask us that before eliminating all of us it's even scary or the answer is yes well the good news I have for you there's like either like AI will you know kill us all or pretty utopia pretty much one or the other at this point I feel so just keep those fingers crossed that's a bizarre design Poor, but I don't have the logic cord yet. I got my ass pushed in a minute ago up here. You ever want to welcome our new AI overlord? That's the way to lick that electronic boot. And lasers freaking hurt. Jokes on you that AI won't take me, I always say thank you to all my electronics. You know, I have found myself actually thanking, you know, chat GBT at times. <laughs> Just because I've, it, it, it's weird too, because I would never do that for any other chat bot. But there are definitely things, that, times I've been like, hey, thanks. And I don't know why. You make a compelling argument against AI being in charge, considering that we currently have. Uh, yes, right now AI has an issue in that it's not aligned with human values. Uh, they talk about alignment issues a lot when it comes to AI researchers, and that before AI can truly be like given proper tasks, is that it has to be aligned with human like belief systems. Otherwise, it might actually just turn us all into paperclips.
Oh, my Fisher Price playside gun. Thank God. First mod for this game, auto vaporize. Please. <laughs> it gets a little old having to do this for all my junk. I guess I don't expect people like me, like, certainly people won't go around picking up everything. Uh, paper clips, that's how we win. We get hit. There, there is like a famous thought experiment of AI turning everyone into paper clips after being given the task of like optimizing paper clip production. Comes a realization like if it just turns everyone into paper clips, it will get the maximum reward. Oh, you seem to be missing a head. Goblin is strong. Yeah, my loot goblin systems are all over the place. <laughs> systems analyzed allows you to use it to monitor the status of Citadel Station systems. But can you blame me? They give me all this beautiful medical waste that breaks down so nicely. <laughs> I mean, how am I even doing this in my inventory, by the way? I just like look at it and it just like vaporizes into dust. Yeah, it's just the kind of alphaness I have. I literally look at shit. <laughs> Turned into block of metal. Human made. It's the remake? It, yeah, okay. Uh, uh, the thing is, everywhere he says, describing the AI that monitors the whole station. Yeah, maybe then not every room. <laughs> uh, battery pack. Stores a fraction of your total energy. Gonna work. The spark beam is an energy weapon that requires energy to use. Press shit. I didn't see that. Press what? Which button was it to like change something? Oh, T. Okay, I can just put it into overcharge mode if I want. What the fuck? Is this the remake? It is the remake. You don't think games in like early 90s look like this, do you? Get rid of the skull, add it to my collection. Alright, we got new key cards. New doors can be unlocked. But not this door. Heard a beep. Ah. Uh. When do you think AI porn will become a thing? It already is a thing. What are you talking about? There's already people using the art image generators to make AI porn. Unless you're asking me when do I think AI will start jerking off to porn? I don't know, but I think that's actually a pretty good idea to maybe stop AI if it ever gets too popular, you know, too powerful. 
Like, all right, you godlike intelligence. Time to hit you with humanity's most powerful weapon. Here's a bunch of, like, naked... <laughs> nakedness. I don't know. You're into that, right? We need to make sure we the, they, they're susceptible to it. I mean, you remember back in the, you know, what was it, like, that's how we, it's in the movies, that's how we always beat some kind of superior enemy, right? It's either like, you know, the virus, like in like, you know, yeah, like in Independence Day, they use a computer virus. Uh, I like to think, or like, you know, in the future, we'll just use like porn to stop, you know, AI from taking over. It makes just as much sense as any other thing you didn't want to, <laughs> when you think about it. It's like, oh yeah, you know what? I bet we will. Water and bacteria killing aliens. Yeah, I mean, it's always something stupid, so why not make it porn? Ooh. Radiation still hurts, even in the future. You know, there's going to be something good in here. If they want to make me get cancer to get it. Or maybe not. In the future, we'll use the computer viruses to get the porn sites to fight the AI. Pornhub will be our John Connor of the future, chat. That di that jingle we have do 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 will be the sound of our resistance. It'll inspire bravery in the hearts of men. Oh, there's a wall there. Wait, I thought there might be a wall there. Nope. Men will fight under the flag of like foreign hub and like do 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 like go on my brother. Fight, live, tell my story. Do 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 do. This this guy is talking to us. I don't think you made it, buddy. We'll send the furries at it. For some reason, they have a lot of money and time. You know what? The future against the AI overlords will look a lot like that Area 51 raid, where everyone's just like twerking in the desert. That's what it's gonna be, isn't it? It'll just confuse the hell out of it because no AI has been trained on that data. You know, it was it used to be like, what is love? And that makes them explode? No, it's like, what is twerking? What, why, human? Why, why, why? <laughs> I think I've got everything in this tinfoil room. Except... That looks like something I can climb up. You need to get a BBL so I can twerk against AI oppression. You know what? First get your STEM degree, then twerk against it. Probably a waste of a bullet, but yeah. Had to be done. You mean all of Borders? They can't get me. We're in a safe place, Jack. This is the game's safe room.
Have you seen the South Park episode that was written by AI? I have not seen South Park in quite a while. By the time AI will be able to gather data to train itself and will all be permanent happiness modified humans. You know what? That doesn't sound like a, such a bad outcome. Probably better than a lot of the other ones we got coming to us. Uh, let's see. Let me... Oof, this map map is map is rough. Uh... Imagine like being on space, and the only thing you had on you when you died was like a bag of Doritos, like all these people. Like that's what they become known as. Like I just had, uh, I just had, I just visit the vending machine, man. Thanks for playing this ironic, iconic game. It wasn't you. I wasn't going to know it was out. For some reason, Steam removed the game from my preferences. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, yep. It's about. It's not even the early access. It's all finished up. And it actually seems like it runs well. And right, like I said, I don't know how well it is compared to the original, but so far, it seems like it's pretty good. Well, that's a trap. I knew there'd be a trap. There's like way more in there. I think I need to use one of those health pellets. They are all naked. Look, it's the future, all right? If you were turned into like a horrible mutant, you wouldn't want to wear clothes either. Yeah, I don't really need two of these, do I? I do not. Stop staring at our invisible junk. They don't even have that. Transdermal dispenser offers a selection of dermal patches for triquets. I... Uh, I've got one triquet. Wires credits. How do I use it? Because I don't have enough? Have you used the Berserk consumable? It causes you to hallucinate enemies from the original game. You mean like 2D sprites? I have not used it yet. Shodan designed them to just like eat humans. There has to be a you know like a scientific reason, right? Hmm, you know what? Let's do this. Good. Many skirts can be hot. You're just now learning this? Well, at this point, I'm getting more color coded key cards than Doom.
take supplies from the West Wing of Medical Costas. Hanson and Reigns. At this rate, we're dead in hours rather than days. Weeks of loss after loss is taking its toll. We're going to rush the access point. Hmm. You return what? Uh, did you get? Did you have a safe drive, Luggy? Or are you still driving? Or are your or your your class your your students still haven't shown up? You know what? It could be one of any of these. Meanwhile, I'm just like in space eating potato chips and drinking soda. Took a break watching streams cause Tears of the Kingdom, but realized I was barely playing it myself. I think for once I'm going to try to beat a game before you. I mean, I'm giving you time. It'll be a few more days before I finish it up. I have to like the Gerudo region left to go to, and that's about it. You know, saving the best for last and all. Well, you know what? Let's try using a frag grenade. Good shit. So, oh shit! Maybe I should have used it on those guys. I'm going to assume we don't get an upgrade our inventory size at some point. <laughs> because I'm, I, most of my inventory is now filled up with, like, scrap. Nope. Drink the soda. Crush the can. Wonder if there's a, any human part that's so optimized AI will use it as an organic extension in 2123. Where if any AI machinery will be organically made, DNA based, when everything, I mean, it's pretty good sci fi concept, I guess. What what organ would you. Uh, personally, I think the penis is, you know, about as perfect as it's gonna get. And the vagina, that seems pretty good too. So there you go, that's the one thing AI is gonna be like, you know what? Can't improve on that. Vaporizing knowledge here, chat. The cock, yes. Nature's perfect design requires no AI improvements. Though you might be asking which which cock of nature, Dartigan, because there are several. And to that I don't quite know. Pretty sure in 2123 humans will have manufactured dick replacements that vibrate. You don't even know the half of it. It'll be it'll do way more than vibrate. People will just literally be dicks. Like, you know, I, I don't want to just have one. I want to be one. Does it give me make me a dick with a pair of legs? You think I'm crazy? Just you watch. Hmm. Hmm. So don't be a dick will become literally exactly. But it'll be impossible. Oh, hello. Ooh. Why they make him so caked up though? <laughs> I mean, why'd they make him so caked up but give them ball sack skin is a better question. I really should not waste my bullets on that. Why am I not using my taser, which is using energy? Yeah, I still don't have the logic port.
Oh, sweet. I've always heard radiation tastes really good. <laughs> like, you can actually taste it. Why am I killing myself slowly? I don't know. Well, there'd be something down here. Welcome back. It's a piece of art now, chat. Yeah, we can't do anything until we get the launching port. Have you asked yourself where are all the zombie poop? I'm assuming they've been, they've had that part of them removed. You know, inefficient and all. that but all right all right uh okay there's this area up here we didn't check out yeah this is old school map design chat let's make it into a maze do we need to worry about the player getting lost yeah we'll just say that's part of the experience it's like you're meant to get lost It. Or I've watched enough to decide to play this eventually. Have fun. Are oh, you getting out of here? Uh, well, you have a good night, Irish. I, I'm glad that I have now participated in selling a copy of this game. On the piece of art. Well, no, I, I thank you, I guess. And I just put... Yeah, I put all my credits in. What are you talking about? I got four credits. Oh, okay, okay. I guess so we can get Berserk or we can get Stamina. Wait, can I get a refund? I don't think I want any of those. I think I should save these for the action. You know what? Whatever. Uh, oh, two. Gotta spend it while you got it. Alright, so we go through this door. Oh shit. Good. Hmm, armory. I don't think I've picked up anything that had a code for that, did I? Oh, finally I can get rid of all this garbage. Oh, fuck! What? And spider robots. Trying to recycle. Like in one of those machines where you just get your like, well, the opposite now. You know those machines where you put your coins in to get actual you know money. Couldn't this have been sped up a little bit? I didn't know in space we'd actually be transacting in very large currency.
Uh, we're, we're rich. Those are Bitcoin chat. There was like 50,000 a piece. You think this guy plays the golem game? He kind of looks like it. This is a little bit, you know what? This isn't the future where there are the blockchains and moo coin. There's only, you know, well, this is a dark timeline where Bitcoin won. Those are Bitcoin, they're chocolate coins. You know what? Probably more value. I make all these jokes about Bitcoin as someone who holds Bitcoin, by the way, so I'm allowed to. <clears throat> and only me. a bitcoin that means you get a bingo sure. i wasn't the one who brought it up though <laughs> so no said cryptocurrency like bitcoin and moocoin i was like all right i'll just go with it and i brought it up in a humanist wa humorous way but then i'm like hey go what you gotta do chat you gotta go buy this bitcoin good for you it's good for you sugarcoat it you're gonna go see spider verse tomorrow is it any good i haven't is it is there reviews out for yet sometimes you know the sequels you know they don't live up Just really piled all the skulls here we have containers for that you know <laughs> Still no shot down the cyborg converter. What does that mean? What does that even mean? <laughs> okay, she literally just attached a blowtorch to a goat. <laughs> like a little vacuum robot. <clears throat> Oof. <clears throat> no respawn well that's why i just save a lot <laughs> works just as well you know Assume the wrench does more damage than this. Why is this happening? A little bit more. How long is this game is there if there is no re there are respawns you just have to find a machine that turned them on on each level of the plane uh, station i believe remember those tanks in bioshock where you if you die you you respawn in them say this is where the this is where it came from so they were more generous with you in that game
was really locked. So chat, what do you think of this game so far, by the way? For those of you that are like fresh to it. You want to see the Barbie movie. I didn't even know that was a thing until like a few days ago. Came in all, all the way in here and radiated myself for two grenades. Okay, it looks like oh, maintenance. Okay, I can't get up there. Delta Quadrant. Delta Quadrant. Central Hub. All right, let's go back this way. That's a long ass hallway. And see if we can go up in this area. How about the new trend? There's a new Transformers movie. The HUD brother bothers me. I don't know why. It just seems mismatched. Uh, there's a lot there. I'll give you that much. Some of it seems a bit unnecessary too. Because if you look at the, both the top left and the top right, they both seem to be indicating my health status. I'm assuming that's what the, the little cardiogram up there is. Like, oh, this is your, what your heartbeat looks like. But I'm not looking at it. I got a freaking health bar over on my right. I sort of think this game like spawns in enemies. I know System Shock 2 would actually randomly spawn enemies here and there. Found the nice chess board you guys can buy me. Oh, that's how that works, is it? You like playing? I played. I used to play chess pretty often back in high school. Not really since then, though. Hmm. Wish, wish. I did teach a few people to play it, though. Left is disabled. That rule is what? Teaching people to play chess? I mean, it was either that or I just didn't play chess because a lot of people didn't know how to play it. This is my only option, really. My older brother was the one who taught me to play it. Literally, my older brother, back when he was cool, before he all the drugs took over, made a chessboard by- oh shit, oh shit. Hold up, I'm panicking. Like, my older brother made a chessboard by taking the piece of cardboard and drawing the squares on it. And then he, like, got crayons and would, like, cut them up and, like, just- Come on. How many? He would like take crayon, different colored crayons act as the different pieces. And that's how I learned. Hmm. Okay. Uh, damaged. And the drink soda. In the future chat, soda will actually be healthy, all right? That's the sweetest thing, yeah. There was like I said, there my older brother, we did not get along later on in life. Uh but when we were little kids and you know still innocent, uh I did like, you know, do the normal like little brother thing of looking up to him because my br older brother was a very gifted freaking artist. And sadly, he ended up wasting that talent by not using it. But, uh, dude could draw, like, that age, like, six, he is fucking amazing at it. I wish I could have had that talent. 
I got no weapon. I got no ammo for this. I got no fire. Coben, Coben, Dennis. What? Did I just pop up on the ground? Come back. Alright, let's figure out where to go. I'm right here. I think I need to head up this way. Because I see, like, hallways I didn't go down. Okay, that's grenade type. Is it supposed to spawn that many of them? You know what? Pretty good Gorism. Uh, I'm like that with drawing, and it's very common for the visual artists to struggle around that age and not trust to get that they have. Yeah, like I said, I'm not even like making it up. When, my, when I say my brother was like just gifted at drawing, like I, it, one of my earliest memories was him just drawing this amazing stuff. And my family did try to support it by getting him like art supplies and books. And he, for a good couple of years, he would just make very good use of it. But then once he like. Hit those teenage years, he got made the wrong friends, got into like drugs and shit. And th th that killed that talent pretty quickly. And I think also his friends made fun of him for it. Like, you like to draw, you know, s F slurs. Like, oh god. Sad times. Let's see, what do I want to do? I want to I wanna not die. How do I facilitate this? I think the game messed up and just spawned in way too many enemies. You know what I just saved? Let me just like, you know, refix this little issue. I'll just chuck another frag grenade over there. I always wanted to be in an orgy, but I didn't think it looked this gross. Ah, th this is probably closer to what they look like, though, isn't it? It's like fluid and like people sprawled out. No, they're not. They're never as sexy as you imagine. I am still waiting on whether I will have a job or not before the end of summer. You still am. Well, I hope you get it, whatever it is. Uh. 
Good. Had a few people well over 42. Who? There was a lot of people just awkwardly like handing and holding everyone's coats. Have I been down there? I don't think I have. dick yet what holding other people's dicks like the dick holder at the orgy is probably the most popular guy there he's like oh that looks heavy sir custom service just for you hmm i'm still locked out of shit Okay, we're at that point where like, yep, I'm lost. You know, with traffic, way better make an orange. What is it? Traffic? Oh, it's easier to make orgy jokes when you're in traffic. Okay, I get you. So a lot easier to do a lot of things when you're not in traffic, surprisingly. I'm beginning to wonder if I miss the logic probe. Let's me like hack some of that stuff from earlier. Uh, I can't really move on until I find it. Your voice text is drunk. Uh, it's not understand what you're. Yeah, but voice text not in will suck. Mother? I think we can go this way. Nope. Uh, this is where I hacked the computers, right? I don't think I need to go back that way. Thing is, I can't... Oh, yeah, I just keep forgetting. Map doesn't mean the game is paused. I didn't want to use no fuck. I didn't want to use my disposable one. Forget that's how that works. This is helping me. Hmm. Shit. 
This, this UI is a little sensitive. Yeah, I've definitely missed something somewhere. Okay, mm I guess we can try checking out this area here again. Requires me to go, what, down here? Can I get to that door? Are you gonna sin or try to- No, I'm not sinning this game. This is just me playing a game for entertainment. It would be very difficult because this game is nothing but audio logs and like, you know, your radio transmissions. That That's awfully hard to work with. I need I need a proper story structure if I want to make something good. Different Bioshock. Bioshock actually has a plot though. Well, this game has a plot too, but it's a bit. It's look, it is a bit similar in that regards. But there's really only one character in this entire game, and that's Shodan, and that's about it. Hmm. I don't really want candy bars. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Miniatures are fun. Here, like, be a book. When it comes to miniatures, I think Warhammer. Then I remember, like, oh yeah, I live in America where those things are super expensive. Hmm. Did I miss. I must. How do I. I need to check my notes. Did I get anything? No, shit. So I don't remember if I got a door code for here or not. Hmm. Cyborg conversion, last resort, KS hiding, destroying the laser medical, join us, Shodan's automated greetings. What about join us? Come to the beta quadrant, oh, nothing there. Healing Suites already done that one. Okay, so I have it. Miss this, wherever it is. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, let's go check it this way. I've clearly missed something. Does anyone ever actually play the Warhammer tabletop? you know, game where they just, like, do it to collect the miniatures. <laughs> I've always wondered that. Like, yeah, I just like collecting the minis. I don't actually play it. What's Warhammer? Is it, like, a table? It's one of those tabletop war games where you have, like, miniature miniaturized figures uh, that you, like, stand in for your... It's basically an RTS game. Where you're like, but you use it on a table and you use a lot of math and rulers, I believe. It's got a very big fan base because it's got pretty good lore. And apparently very good miniatures. Yes. 
Like I've never played it, but I know a lot of the you know, a lot of lore for it. You know, back here is where I think I messed up somehow. Your boyfriend in college liked to play one called Twilight Imperium. That actually sounds like something Warhammer related practically because of the word Imperium in there. You memo, you memo, what? I feel like you're trying to help uh, Kalazar, 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 but I, I'm not getting your message. Oh, wait a minute. We can, so oh shit. I should have been solving these earlier. Forgot you can like do this. Yeah, I think. Yeah, okay. Okay. I solved it. That's all I had to do. Played a few times with them. I haven't beat them once. They were so upset uh, that I had a lot. They were upset that you enjoyed yourself. <laughs> what? What kind of logic is that? I can't believe she actually enjoyed that. Why do we even invite her? Heavy breathing. I think they just unlocked quick access back to it. Okay, yeah. Voice text drunk again. Uh, not that they didn't want me to have fun. I had a lot of fun. They were very happy. Had fun. Okay, that makes more sense. Honestly, though, the, the alternate reality where they got upset that you had fun sounds funnier to me. And sounds more in line with, like, awkward nerds. Well, the paper. Did I play the original System Shock? No. <laughs> nope. That's a little, the little uh, outside my tastes. Uh, that, that the original System Shock is old as hell, and trying to play it has been described as like essentially trying to play like, you know, a Windows boot operating system. <laughs> it's it's less of a game and more like yell yeah, that. It's like yeah, so yeah, it, it's 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 a rough time playing it these days. So I've been waiting until uh, yeah, I got my hands on the remake. I have played System Shock too though. Mind you, not all the way through, but I did play it many years after it already come out as well. Also, the women have massive earth shaking boobage. I'm sorry, what? Are they, which which anime are you describing? Or you know, reality? I'm not sure. They could be in any number of things. Am I still out of ammo for my mag pulse? Yeah. What use is this thing? Love the fact that yeah, I will enter and leave conversations at weird moments. It adds to the charm, you realize. Because you never know when I'm gonna read your comment and just be completely lost. Hat. 
vapor vaporize the toilet paper we don't need any more we're a cyborg we don't where we live now we don't need to wipe our ass robots do it for us oh actually got full health nice You know, it is kind of weird when you think about it that we have yet to come up with a better op- Well, actually, we, never mind. I was about to say, we have yet to come up with a better way of optimizing the cleansing of our backsides. But I remembered I have a bidet. And I was like, oh yeah, I left the old toilet paper losers back in the past years ago. And I even had the foresight to do that before you know, COVID hit. So when everyone else was panicking about underwear, you will know, buy my underwear. But uh, uh, you know, toilet paper, I was like sitting there pretty on my like throne of you know, like, genius. Like, yep, this is what it's all about. You know, thinking ahead, you know, you gotta have the big ideas. Again with the bidet flex. You, you think I'm not going to keep flexing that? Look, until everyone else realizes that they're doing things wrong by using a dry piece of, like, crunchy toilet paper, I'm going to keep doing it. For a bidet, you, they cost like 20 bucks. The they're, they're about as expensive as a new toilet seat cover. I think you may be thinking of those like actual fully installed separate bidets that rich people might have. No, literally like a bidet is like a new toilet seat cover with a water pipe that attaches to your like water line. It it's, it's, takes like five minutes to install and you're done. <laughs> it's no excuse. And what's more, it pays for itself. Because you're not buying toilet paper, or very much toilet paper. So you end up actually making money off your bidet, chat. Because you don't have to like... Like a single like 12 pack of toilet paper will last you all year because you only need like two sheets to like dry. That's it. This stream is sponsored by Bidet Incorporated. That's cleansing, smooth feeling. Go with bidet. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's like, I buy toilet paper once a year. That's about it. Oh, we found the snack bar. Uh, watching your stream is the best part of my your day. Well, thank you. I'm glad I bring joy into whatever your well into your your. I think it's your life. I don't know what I was like struggling to come up with something to say there and you, you, you bring joy into something. Before my parents got divorced, we lived in this insane mini mansion thing and I had a separate uh, bidet that I thought was the fountain for, you know, I thought that as a kid too. I thought like, why did they have a fountain in their toy in their, I mean, a, a water fountain in their bathroom? I was literally like, I think the first time I saw one was watching that that movie Crocodile Dundee where he doesn't know what it is either. <laughs> He's just like trying to wash his boot in it. And I was like, because I figured that, yeah, I'd probably do that too. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, it's a boot washer. Of course that's what it's for. Smart, rich people things. I still don't understand why so many people are opposed to bidets. Tell me, chat, what is your best... They just wrote the system stock. Oh, system stock. 
What is your reason for not wanting to use a bidet? I want I want to see your logic. Most of the world has already been convinced that bidet is the way to go. It's only like the holdouts are like yo in America. As always. In Europe I remember having a full on bidet toilet that I was too scared to use for a few years. Uh well I I think all children I was I was terrified of the toilet as a child. You're like you're gonna fall in, you know, or at least you think you are. Where'd that gun you go, go gun that you had drop? You have soft toilet paper and it feels nicer. Yes, but water is as soft as you get. <laughs> hmm. What's the biggest splurge I've ever bought for myself? Uh mm, computer stuff. But for me, that's not really a splurge, it's a business purchase. <laughs> Uh, I'm a big guy. I don't think you'll get all of it. Well, your cheeks kind of spread. That's like saying I'm a big guy. I can't get it all out at the same time. Like, you know, you, you, the told reason of the seed is like, you know, spreadage. You're afraid you might come. Oh, well, I can assure you that never happens unless you already you're like into that. Seven oh five. Uh, that's what I was looking for. Seven oh. Someone in chat remembers seven oh five for that. Yo. I think that's for that. Uh, the armory. Hmm. Never been able to come from water pressure. Like I know there's a thing that girls use the shower head. Yeah, I've always wondered about that too. I used to think that was something that girls just made up. Like, oh yeah, the shower head. I guess if you angle it right, maybe. Damn, you dead. Oh shit. Ah. You guys dead? Oh, you're just stunned. Shower head, you say? Wouldn't mind that. Ah, oh. some people's boyfriend, you know. Please give me your potato chips. <laughs> I'm a I'm a cyborg that's just fueled by junk food. Hmm. All right. Oh yeah. Okay. We're in new new territory. And I can't save. You're fucking dead. <laughs> Watch your ammo, big, big. I know it's like an overcharge mode. I needed it for like killing the big guy. Uh, this will take me down. Oh wait, I might need another shot. Actually, this is not ammo I'm shooting with this gun. This is powered by my battery. Hmm. 
junk food please <laughs> chat stop arguing over something stupid As American as it gets? What, what did I say that makes me that gives away my Americanness? Eat junk food and shoot you. Okay, Nimron, you're right. You, gotta, you made a good point. Oh! You are not welcomed here. Remove yourself. That's what it's like when I'm streaming and someone's being a dick in chat. good interpretation mm, I heard a camera are you annoying I don't think so course is busted. Hey, open the door for me, buddy. I need you to hit this switch. Got new hires, I'm in. <laughs> hmm. Didn't even clean up all the medical waste. Chad, I think I can safely say I'm digging this game. Hmm, what? Not exactly the map system. That can eat it. Most paparazzi are actually lonely people. I think most paparazzi are just like people who are annoying because they spend their life, you know, photographing people for a living. They don't want to be photographed. What's up, doctor? How you doing today, man? Hope you've had a good one. Hmm. What else do I get in there if not this guy opening the door for me? Lucky is a theater teacher and master's holder. Yep. She's a talented girl. Also, star of several commercials, and I believe an indie film, right? You know what? It's supposed to, they're supposed to look creepy, but come on. It looks like they just like they look like a kid who got a hold of their mom's lipstick and just put it all over their face. It it just it gives me that effect. All right, I won't bother you, sir. Actually, I gotta bother you because there's only way out of here is through you. <laughs> this ain't turning on without your you access. Let's see, isn't there a SCP that looks just like that? There are many SCPs. I don't know of all of them. Wait a minute. It, really, that's how it works. <laughs> lost yet? I'm, no, I got lost for a bit, but I figured it out. I didn't actually get lost. I just didn't realize I could already do the puzzle.
Here the remake is terrific. Like I said, I've never played the original, so I have no idea how good it is compared to that. I mean, I think it's probably pretty good. I, there's no way I could play even play the original. <laughs> but I'm liking it. Hey, Darnie, ever play Clay Fighter 63 and one thirds? No. My elbow hurts, Chet. He's doing pull ups today. Did a few too many, I think. Uh, but it's it's a good pain, you know. Full of extra testosterone and all. You exercise, I know, right? Gross. You love doing pull-ups. They're not my favorite. I don't know. I feel like some people are just good at doing certain exercises, like. Pull-ups I don't like, but I know they're good for me. So I do them just because, you know, it's like you gotta, when you gotta like eat the broccoli when you're a kid. You just do it. It's, it's a good pain. It is, I mean, it is. I mean, your muscle, you know, doms, it's a good pain. Let you know you're doing the right thing. But, uh, you do pull-ups, you can't even catch a bullet and jack. You don't get to say that about everything. Where did you even come? Oh. You know, I don't know if they should really be storing medical waste here in the cantina. <laughs> really got to question the staff. Wait, I can I can vaporize the block. Wait, oh, that just gets rid of it. Oh shit. All right. Oh. Hmm, you're the kind of guy who has strong upper body strength but shit stamina. So I like doing workouts that require short bursts so like high intensity, you know, yeah, that's pretty common actually. Like I said, I feel that some people are just really there's some people that just seem innately good at certain exercises. That's why you can find some people who can like belt out like a 100 put uh pull-ups in a row or more or do like a hundred push-ups out stomping uh but i'm not one of those guys i do them in like you know sense so because you know i fucking hate pull-ups <laughs> like i said they're good for you so i do them that's my yeah that's that's pretty much how i treat all exercises it's good for me so i do it it's a good way to like spin the yield that excess time instead of just dwindling okay, which ways have i been Okay, uh, we gotta go up this way. Also, this exciting direction. You can vaporize trash to turn it into those small... That's what I've been doing. But I also learned you can vaporize those small cubes to get rid of it from your inventory. Is that up? He'll come around. Once she finds out how well I'm cleaning this place up of all the garbage, she's gonna love me. Once the tachyon mining beam is calibrated, we will begin to pu purify the human cities of Earth. Hold up. Aren't we near Saturn? How are we going to shoot Earth with a laser? Our 
our purity to flourish is almost complete. Their rotting corpses will provide the food for my, my world to grow and prosper. Pretty sure this orbit, no, this is orbiting Saturn. We can see it outside the windows. It's got the ring and everything. I don't think a mining laser is going to reach all the way from Saturn to Earth. But she said this deal is controlled by her alone. Seems like I can get into it too. But I don't want to yet. Just tell Shodan you have a bidet. She'll bow down like, oh, she's calling me insect. She, wait till she finds out I use a bidet. <laughs> I'm not like those other humans, you know. Yeah, I'm going to continue exploring the map here. I don't know if we can leave this level yet or not. Like, I think we need to destroy more security, right? System security is at 48%. Trying to figure out what my next read should be. Any suggestions, chat? Uh, I was recommending a book just the other night that I think is really good. It's called Still Life with Woodpecker. Actually, it's a very weird novel, but I think it's excellent. Uh, I'm not really... Wait, do I actually get ammo for that now? No, I do not. Maybe I should just store this gun. Nah, no. I might find some use for it. I always recommend House of Leaves. I feel like I've heard that, but I don't remember what it is about. Standard station restoration procedures online. I'm glad I found this after I'd explored the entirety of the level. Now I don't have to worry about dying anymore. I've also said my, mentioned before my favorite novel of all time is Snow Crash. Uh, so anyone wants to read that? I recommend. No reason to waste ammo on you. Trying to make a movie of Snow Crash since 1996, I wouldn't expect it to happen anytime soon. I really think it'd be a made into a video game, actually. That's what it was originally was going to be when he was originally writing it, was as a video game. Because that actually would make a pretty awesome, like, open world deal video game. Just ordered this awesome sounding book called Still Life with Wook. Well, I'm glad you took my recommendation. I think you'll love it. Right up your alley. Let me know once you start reading it, actually. Auto vaporize. <laughs> I 
Guys, you heard this awesome book called The Bible? Tell us about it. What's it about? Mutagen experiment V5 to, to, to Beta Grove on the executive level. Let the virus loose in the grove and uh, observe its effects on, on flora and fauna. Collect samples from the mutated. Kill those who have not shown progress. And, and we will soon have a perfected strain that will consume the earth, allowing me to reach This is where COVID the began. Insect, the insects in my perfect image. It's about a time a guy named God said, let there be light, and there was light, and it was good. But didn't he create the stars in the heavens above on the sixth or fifth day? Where was, where was that light coming from? Let there be light. Oh, yeah, I'll get around to making the stars you know, later on this week. It's one of those oopsies, I guess, moments. You know, I'm not a religious person, but as a kid, I did have the, this awesome, like, graphic novelization of the Bible that I would read because it's just fucking sick. <laughs> it wasn't religious at all, but I was like, I'd read that back to front, like, every couple months because it was that good. It was, it, was, it was quality work. It was kind of creepy, too, because some of the drawings were, like, just... I feel like they got a horror artist to, like, draw them out. So, like, all the bigger, like, you know, not, you know stories of, like, the, the Bible. Like, done in graphic detail. Why are you bashing God? I'm not. Just in case anyone, you know, you know feels that way. I respect you and your beliefs. Oh, okay. God is not in that room, though. Searching. Call the Bible the Bibble instead. I feel like you need to, you know, like people who would like the Bible and read it you know, rather often aren't going to take kindly to trying to change his name. They usually only do that every few centuries, actually. You know, and they have a big convention and all that. Oh, fuck me. I just thought I could pick that up. It's shiny. Thank God I did all that for crackers. <laughs> Actually, not even crackers. We did that for the vending machines. Uh, yeah, I'm not wasting my money on snack food. Especially since it doesn't really heal that much. Uh, I will pop another one of these though. I've got quite a few of them though. I like stealth kill this dude. chat Saturn there's and we're planning to shoot the earth with a mining laser for sure that is even though we're all the way out here doesn't make a lot of, you know what I probably maybe I could send this game spoiler it's not a spoiler it's really what they said a minute ago stocked up on soy food and deus ex you'd be surprised how effective they can be I believe you can crush people with them well, you can also eat them for health, but 
You can, like, throw the packets around. Well, you can't crush them. You can throw the packets around to, like, make distractions, I think. Yo, the, the Illuminati is easily distracted by soy. How much does System Shock 2 change from this game? In terms of what what it is, it's pretty much the same thing. You're on, on instead of a space station, you're on a spaceship that's been, they re like... <clears throat> Uh, basically, it takes place a few decades later. Humans have discovered faster than light technology, and you're on the first ship that's going to Tal City 5 as it's for its maiden voyage. And basically, the same thing happens. You go to sleep, and you wake up in a medical bay, and when you wake up, there's, like, mutants everywhere. Uh, but there is one major change in that, for most of the game, Shodan is your ally working with you against the mutants. All right, let's deal with all these robots in here. Uh, EMP. EMP kind of sucks. Saves coming time. Gonna throw a grenade in there. <laughs> it's just better options, you know? Oh, 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 no! Oh, 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 fucking door! <laughs> oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, that one didn't count. Trying to line up my my angle. I only got one, huh? Uh, yeah, yeah, now you guys are stuck in there with it. Spit, laughed, tea. Excellent. Most of the in 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 insects have either died or were reborn. Re 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 Small resistance pockets remain. I will cleanse them from my body soon. <laughs> have a delayed laugh, but I'll still allow it. To suit my purposes. Earth shall receive my magnificence, my glory. My great works will begin once I arrive, and there shall be no other gods before me. You are back. Music from the bar behind my apartment sounds like Final Fantasy guitar. Oh, yeah, that's easily distracting, isn't it? Oh, sniper space again. No other gods before me, that doesn't mean there aren't other gods. You know, that's actually from the Bible itself. It doesn't technically say there aren't other gods, it just says you're not supposed to have them before your the Lord.
Because this descent is based on descent. Because a venture capitalist like the rest of us? Pardon? Oh, you mean God is a venture capitalist? Does he take an investment? Imagine had you invested in Jesus back when he came out, chat, you'd be so rich, right? <laughs> like, people doubt it. Like, yeah, this ain't gonna take off. I'm just looking for a small investment in my organization. <laughs> Original version had no walls. Yeah, I believe it was like, well, it was all wireframe, so you couldn't, you could see through the wall, so it made like navigating a hell, from my understanding of it. You didn't have text, you still could like pass through them, but you could see through it, and you just didn't know which one, which way you go half the time. And I believe the final boss fight was in cyberspace in the original, wasn't it? I don't know if I'm not going to make it through this one alive. This is, this is pretty... Jesus was a carpenter. Imagine buying a house from him. Yeah, and keeping it. Original Jesus built home. Put that one up on your... On your for sale. Hmm. Trying to sell my house and say Jesus built it, you know, I think that might be illegal. Also, where is your house located? If it's anywhere outside of like, you know, you know, Israel, or you know, you might have a hard time making people. Yeah, you know, I'd sell my home here in Michigan. Jesus built it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? Jesus got into the tiny house Christ. Isn't that almost like a scam or something? So along with like, yo, like, hey man, let's live in a shipping container. Well, probably more sort of the shipping container than the, sh the tiny house. The shipping containers, you know, that aren't exactly made for living in. You know what my favorite comment from the Bi commitment from the Bible is? You shall not boil a kid in its mother's milk. I don't think that's one of the commandments. I mean, that's a lot of milk too. That's going to take a while to collect. That was an actual commandment, or it just was just some random part of the Bible. Is it in Leviticus? I feel like all the crazy shit comes from Leviticus. Was a fucking grenade. Oh, it was a health capsule. Shit. Let's do a gas grenade. Hmm. Pretty sure boiling kids in milk is allowed. You know what? I'll allow it. Tis gives a pleasing aroma to the Lord. Favorite story from the Bible was King Saul dared David to collect a hundred Philistine foreskin foreskins foreskins. Yeah, I've heard about that one. 
My favorite part of the Bible is where it explicitly calls out how big the dicks of the Egyptians were. It's like, literally. It's like, phalluses longer than the Nile. Or something along. It's very poetic. <coughs> Complete global saturation. Dick. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's canon. I mean, like, they, like, literally, like, like, they, some, at some point, the Bible talks about how big the, the dicks of the Egyptians. I don't know why. I don't remember the context. I think it was actually meant as an insult, is even. Oh, no, I'm out of juice. So thank you for the bits, by the way. What was the last thing on TV I watched? Uh, Jojo. Since around radar, you know, utilize the radar system to scan around and use it to locate useful items at the expense of small amounts of energy. Not a healthy zone. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Uh, yeah, well, the Stone Ocean you know, story arc that was came out last year. And yea, the Lord said unto the Egyptians, damn you thick. And it was good. You know, we had to give them something. Also, three creation stories. The one where animals are made, then man. And one where man is made, then animals, Adam and Eve. And the one where God kills the Leviathan and uses the dragon's body to create the world. There's also, yeah, there's also, isn't there like one where like Adam's first wife was like you Lilith? You young boys, Valdez. Shut up. There's no way, no good time for that to ever show up, is there? But I uh, think you for the bits. But yeah, I remember they're like Lilith. Lilith was like his first wife, and then you know, then then not anymore. Like you know what? I'm gonna make this, take this rib bone out of you. Seems like a pretty good idea. And then like all the goth writers of the future would like latch on this idea of Lilith as like, yes, queen. <laughs> this is our this is our goth goth girlfriend that God himself rejected. Where am I headed to? I mean, you can't get more goth than God himself kicking you out of the house, can you? I hear, I obey. Checking. Then we gotta destroy these. Uh, God didn't make a wife for Adam until he saw he was lonely. And he, oh wait, you don't want to fuck these animals? <laughs> Omniscient being, yeah, a little bit of an oversight. Look, uh, it's about a couple thousand years before I like let humans invent antidepressants. Can you just like not be that, Adam? God, why did I make you an extrovert? You with a woman, you can't even catch a ball. Yeah, that'd be fucked up. He makes Adam an extrovert, but didn't make any other people. I've always... Something I've always wondered. How did... How, how did humans continue if there was only just Adam and Eve and their children? I mean, isn't that implying something? Something that I think most people in Fade don't like talking about. Because we know that it doesn't really make a bit of sense. Isn't that just mean that, like, yeah, we had to, like, 
whole lot of incest. If even, I mean, like, hardcore, like, brother-sister stuff, too. How come the pastors never bring that up? Alright, we gotta destroy these. Also, never said because Cain got a wife from somewhere and she wasn't from Adam. Yeah, where'd that come from? <laughs> God had a few spares. Like, you know, I took a few other of Adam's ribs. All right, uh, if I throw a frag grenade in there, will it destroy all of them? Global security is not... Logical explanation is that Adam and Eve had hundreds of children. Damn, so bad for Eve. Historical explanation is that even if they did, it doesn't matter. It's still tons of incest. Historical explanation is that the ancient Israelites didn't care that they were telling the origins of their own people, and Adam and Eve was their specific origin. In other words, made it fuck off. What's the history of the twelve tribes of Israel? Really fascinating. It's also been used in a lot of sci-fi. Hmm. I don't know if that number is important or not. Seven. Maybe a door code. Supposedly God made more people beside Adam and Eve. Yeah, but it's like fucked up. That, mean, that means all the people who came after Adam and Eve, he like punished for Adam and Eve's like discretion. Like I know you guys, I made you guys afterward and you weren't there. Uh, but uh, you know what? All that shit I, you know, yeah, it's gonna apply to you too. Sorry. This is. All right, seven, chat. I, I do recall at some point I need those numbers that you get from, like, destroying the security. So we'll make, real, we'll make a note. And I don't think the game itself, like, will we'll put it anywhere for you. There we go. Also, sexism, women were punished by having painful births, but men get crickets. I wonder what God's original plan for birthing was then, if he had to, like, change it to make it painful. Doesn't that imply he had a different idea? And that, and this was like, you know what? Fuck that. You know what? No. You're gonna, like, shoot it out of your vag now. See how you like that. Teach you to fucking talk to snakes. Alright, I think we actually can leave this. Yeah, I think we've done everything. Which one was the elevator? This is the elevator I need to go to, right? I think. I didn't get every camera, but I guess I don't need to. Chat is horny again? I don't really see any horny posting right now, actually. Oh, 
not yet. Uh, no. You want me? Or what? Look, I can help you with your math homework. Okay, yeah, there's the other, and there we are. Kissing lessons? Is that some form of algebra? <laughs> Sorry, but for some reason I like this this stupid line for your per, of Back. questioning. Back. They're onto his chat. Good timing on the hey listen. Right as Shodan is like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, but thank you for the bits, logical. 24 hour stream, damn. Don't you do those pretty often as well? Alright, I think we're good. Let's go to the next level. We're going to research. Three hour maps are good. When they're when they're like this, yeah. That's like maybe like one and a quarter map a night. And this is how many maps there are. Like we've done medical, and there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, 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 hello, shit. Ow, 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 ow. I can't shoot when you're up close like this. Fuck. I didn't realize that was a thing. They body hugged me. Have you seen those streamers that sleep on strip? Yeah, I don't get that, by the way. I mean, I understand you gotta. Oh, oh, yeah. You gotta keep making content, but is that really content at that point? I guess it's just, you have to do a 24 hour stream, you gotta leave it running. So you don't really have a choice. But thank you for the bits, by the way. Yep. But hey, we don't get turned into an evil thing anymore. That's an improvement. Is there an actual consequence, consequence to dying once you have that turned on? Why is this music still playing? I'm not on the elevator anymore. If, if Shodan actually wanted to kill us, she'd just play this over the speakers the entire time. You're in the elevator of life, huh? This better not be a glitch, it sticks with me. Oh, and they're all dead? What? Huh? Okay. <laughs> I think that was a bit of the game, like, fucking up. Fuck it, walkie a little bit. <laughs> Music stop, thank like God. Is it? Is it really? Walkie walkie, yes. That, that's how you know someone's serious when they use that word. Why hold on to these delusions? 
You got sick on your birthday? I'm sorry, man. I've had that happen before. Can't even enjoy the cake. Hopefully it wasn't food poisoning or anything. Alright. Feel better now, but I was sick. Get on my Leah. Okay, let me... Also, thank you for the bits again, by the way. I'm not sure what they were for, but I appreciate it. It was in fact food... Oh, that's like the... That's like one of the few sicknesses that game can give me. What the fuck? You just like plop that on the ground, do you? He's like, yeah, I'll get you after you after I die. No. But the music was playing because of the nut sound effect, because it, the timing was perfect. Nut music. Darcy's gone. They nearly got me. I went looking for him, but he knows he knew better than to be there for any longer than an hour. One shot in the back of the head. Hmm. Sure, what I should be doing now. Uh, 24 hour, I got a, I got a neck road, a 22 HC, and died of that stupid brood mother spider boss. So, what, what would, what's your opinions on Diablo 4? Night Dive Studios always deliver. Besides this game, the Romero, yeah, they do a good. Well, they had some issues making this game. They, this, this, they definitely was not an easy time making this. At first, they were actually going to reimagine it. One of those reimagined re remakes where it's not exactly a one-to-one -one recreation. And apparently, people didn't like that, so they switched gears. So they had to restart development a few times. And it just took freaking forever. <laughs> Comfy PJ time. You know what? Sounds good. Is it the floofy kind? You know, the breathable kind? There's a lot, you know, a lot of variety of PJ. Gotta respect the dedication and integrity. I mean, I like what they do. I gotta admit, yeah, I, I am a fan of them, like, making sure old games, you know, stay playable. And you'll have, like, new life. That is admirable. I wish they were a lot bigger so they could like do that to more games. Uh, mm, how much money do I actually have on me? I got a hundred. Maybe I should buy some stuff. Comfy loose sweater with stars on and blue shorts that are probably cottage. Okay. Yeah, that sounds about right. Isn't 100 bucks in this game like a lot of money? I've been recycling everything. I've picked up nearly everything I can come across and turned it in. I got even like another stack of money waiting for me once I find the recycler again. Oh shit, it's one of these fucking puzzles. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, well, we can do it. Can't wait for what they do with... Didn't they actually release a rem... Not a remaster of it, but... Uh, they re-released System Shock 2? 
at the same time as this game with like updated models and stuff. But not quite the same. It's obviously not to this degree. Uh, okay. Okay, that was easy. Never mind. Keep thinking those are going to be super hard. Look, so many mines. Well, now we're stocked up nice. Releasing enhanced edition of ooh, System Shock 2. It's still being worked. Okay, I thought it had already been released. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't do everything. It just makes it, you know, play a little modern machines and... I think it replaces like enemy models to make them less look blocky and replaces some textures too. Uh off the right, what is this? What are the what are these things? The extra health and energy. Uh, Dragon's Breath... Okay, I bought Dragon's Breath runs. Okay, didn't know what I was buying, actually. But that was like a permanent upgrade. Hmm. Wait, do you even up permanently upgrade any of your stats in this game? And this is... Lachetta runs. Do I really not have any ammo for this thing? What does this gun take? Mag pulse rifle. Ammo magnetic pulse cartridge. I guess I've just found nothing for it. I have the original System Shock on Steam because I bought System Shock 2 a long time ago. The original version of this game is damn near unplayable. I actually owned it too and thought I'd try playing it, but yeah, it's not something I could get into. Bit Dart has a stash of comfy oversized hoodies. I do have a few hoodies, actually. Uh, like, strangely enough, I've got, the, the, like, I have two Discord partner hoodies and then I have, like, like a Streamlabs hoodie as well. So a lot of the hoodies I own have, have come for me as, as part of my privilege. It's like, oh, you're a partner with us now. Let me let's send you a hoodie. And they're they're actually pretty good damn quality too. Right, chap. Once you get in a man of my position, you get free hoodies. People will like literally like, hey, will you will you, you want this hoodie? I'm like, yeah. you know what? I'll take that off your hands. Wow. I know, right? It's the, my intense lifestyle, you know? Free hoodies. Put the stand this a little bit for the time being. You want any other monsters? Want to make a fan hoodie for my avatar using your avatar? You mean like my face over there? Sure, be my guest. To be fair though, I probably should have changed my avatar a long time ago. Chemical canister. I don't really need two of these. More trash type. At some point, I really need to stop just picking up all the garbage. Uh, Dart should use the gay flag forever in his background. Like I said, that that was a misconception. People thought I had a gay flag, <laughs> like the the rainbow flag. It was not. It was never meant as that. I didn't want to take credit for like making some kind of statement. 
I just asked the artist to give me the dumbest looking thing he could think of, and he just put a rainbow back in there. I didn't even think of it. I was like, you know what? That's fine. Put a rainbow on it. But then I kept getting people coming into chat and asking, hey, are you gay? And I was like, what? Where, where are you getting that idea from? And I was like, you're, 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 you're PFP. I was like, oh. Oh, what the fuck? COVID? <laughs> That's not how big viruses are supposed to be. This is a bit goofy, chat. I, I literally fought COVID virus particles. And mutated again, chat. Got the coof. You know I should have been picking up so much medical waste. Goofiness in my system shock? I yeah, I know, right? What do you would do great in gaming sins? Darting and wood. Uh, yeah, yeah. Maybe I'll give that a shot. Seems like a possible career path. Guess I'm good in there. Yeah, it's covered. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they just like drew well. A lot of vi virus particles can look the same, but you know, given you know recent history, they probably say, so, you know, I just throw COVID in there. I don't know how you have a, a floating virus particle as big as a basketball, though. The whole part of a virus is that it's tiny. Another one. Go watch a Goofy movie. It's been a while since I've seen that. Oh, what does this one plug into? Since we're speaking of animated movies again, I will always recommend Princess Mononoke. Hmm. I gotta get this up a few. Who's breathing in ASMR for me? Wonder what the 2070s will be like. You'll be a funky old lady. Well, like I said, keep your head up. At that point, will either all humans will be dead or we'll all be like cyber gods, who knows? The way current AI seems to be going. Hmm. That's not good. This is a very obtuse puzzle design, by the way. Whoop, oh, shit, no. I don't know if that helped or not. I think it's a cute. Uh, oh, well, I will. I told some kids today at the school my, uh, my age when they asked and they freaked out. It was hilarious. Kids are stupid, though. <laughs> I think that made it worse. Operator. Hmm. I 
Yeah, this, this is the weird part of it, because you don't know how... I'm pretty sure, like, the energy values change depending on which one of these are plugged in, but they don't tell you what the energy values are. Oh, wait a minute, I guess... Like, some of them are, like, light blue and some dark blue, but that doesn't... Okay, I guess that means it's two, and that means it's one. Whatever that means, though. The puzzle, yeah, but it's a dumb one. I'm, I'm guessing I got this part right, but it's like figuring out what how these go in, probably. It just doesn't help me that this part is like, I don't really get how you're supposed to you know, do the math on it. Maybe... You're getting pissed off. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like three power nodes away from solving it, but I can't figure out where it wants me to connect things. <laughs> I don't know if I even need to get in there, but yeah, probably do. This is mandatory, but yeah, I believe so. Uh... It's a little too, uh, can't you change the difficulty after you start? I mean, I don't really want to do that, though. Oh, uh, that feels like, ex see, the thing is, like, I get this part of the puzzle. That part is understandable. It's just, like, these have different power values, I guess. Two lights mean more power, so we got this one. It's only, like, one, but I don't, Okay, I'm thinking... What would it be? Would it be because the amount of, like, like maybe a two power slot needs to go into this because it's sending out two? So let's do this. But most of them only have one power. Okay, this one maybe as well. Oh wait. Okay, it's close, but what's wrong? There's still something off. I'm only two away. Where where did I get the extra power? Oh, there we go. There we go. Save. I never want to do that at puzzle again. Psychiatrist said you got the tism. I think I'd find a new psychiatrist. Look at the tism. Yeah, it's not exactly a good description.
I mean, there's there obviously the, the tism as in autism, which I'm assuming is what that would mean. But I feel like if you're giving a medical prognosis, you don't use slang. Like, what if your doctor is doing, like, an organ transplant, and in the middle of it, he's just like, yeah, that fucking slapped. Fat dub on transplanting that heart into this guy's chest. He's just like, you know what? I think I want a new doctor. You're being goofy. You see, we take everything deadly seriously in this chat. Because that's how you make content. And we also live in a clown world where I could totally see that happening. Why are you awake during surgery? I mean, people have woken up during surgery, but where there's actually some oh, some surgeries where you have to remain awake too. Go back. You can hear your doctor say that during the surgery I have bigger concerns than my doctor speaking slang. I mean, I suppose so. But maybe before the surgery, he's like, yeah, we're going to be like do a fat dub and just drop this new heart in your chest today. Finally found the donor. Like, yeah, I was playing Fortnite earlier before surgery. Really gets me, you know, prepares me mentally for the surgery I'm going to perform. Now, about that kidney. You wouldn't trust the doctor. So I would question. I'd begin to question. I mean, you, know, you, you got you got to. That was your own safety. Oops! I probably should not use the overcharged shot for that guy. Surgeon drops the scalpel in my cranium, guessing had a mind of its own, or like awesome loot drop. Just like in Diablo, when like all the stuff falls out of things, when I cut it open. Mm hmm. Not sure if I want to go that way. Malpractice payment would also drop through, but it's going to take a while. Really need to find that recycling unit, Severn. Cyborg conversion cancelled. Standard station restoration procedures online. Cyborg conversion cancelled. Alright. Sounded like a good thing. Yeah, forgot about the cameras. I've been missing those this entire time. Always got doctors who crack jokes like before I fell asleep. One said, What side am I cutting? Hey, doctors cracking jokes is perfectly fine, to be honest with you. Usually want some of them when relatable. But they usually crack very safe, you'll you'll comforting jokes. Except for dentists, man. Dentists got that, you know, that, that sadist in them. Uh, 
though I have been pretty fortunate, I have a pretty good dentist. Always done great work. No complaints. Hmm. I have 100% go sex change right when doing a medical circumcision, and that's how you became an enemy of many people. You're laughing at how two dentists Loki hit on me during treatment at the same time? Two Sarah guys. I was gonna say usually in the dam. Though I do feel that's a little unprofessional, to be honest. Like you know, there's a there's a time and place for that. Oh yeah. I mean, I guess that would be the time and place. Remember, that's gonna save us from our AI overloads in the future. That that music. Thank you. Hmm. Have a good one. I go Tetsu. Have a good night, man. Thanks for joining me. Fuck out. <laughs> Fucking turns into a melee attack on me. Fuck. Turns out I'm immortal though, so it doesn't matter. Where, where, where did I just die at though? This could use like one of those like you died here. Uh, markers. Haymakered by a turret. Yeah, I didn't expect that the, the turrets would be able to do that. Usually they don't. They've been upgraded. Done this way, right? There you go. You asked and you received. One day I'm going to count how many fucks you say for fun. I mean, I probably don't. I'd be embarrassed. I swear too much. Shit. <laughs> that, that was not intentional, by the way. As I don't like wasting ammo. COVID again. Didn't mean to shoot your shot that early. What shot did you shoot? Hmm. The perfect bile up. Well, I don't know if I'd call it that. It's no uh, Ouroboros.
Man, can I find the recycling machine soon? You know what? Use that. Ooh, ooh, oh, ooh, yeah, <laughs> nasty. Complete global saturation. Good timing of me as soon as I, that guy's face popped up, by the way. And? It's above my pay grade, I know. But what the hell is the AA doing with that much power? Make you laugh out loud? Good. That's the whole point. I feel like I should be able to crawl through this fucking bathtub streams, but you can't. I mean, I mean, I, I, why would I want to? I guess I can't get in there. The answer to the conflict mediation and lawsuit potential is just to remove vocabulary a la 1984. I have no idea what that smart shit you just said is about, but I agree. Okay, this way. Nope, 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 you're not friendly. Birds are the worst fucking thing in the game. Goldeneye ricochet noises. I've only played Goldeneye briefly at a friend's place. It's one of the. It's actually the first 3D game I ever played. Nineteen four is a bit like the book, The Giver. Oh yeah, I know. About, I know about the novel. I didn't know if that's what you're actually like. I thought you were comparing it to something actually. <laughs> yeah, I, I literally read it. For fuck's sake, you know what? You guys get an impede. Robots? Fucking tough. <laughs> I think I should like keep out the, the ammo that is better against them. I think I'm using the wrong ammo. Oh, look, what do we got? We got like Teflon, armor penetration, standard. Yeah, we need to be using that. That'll do as well. Hmm. Hmm. Need to stretch my arm out a little bit. Oh, what's up? Uh. Fucking hell though, man. I need to lay off doing exercise on that arm for a while. 
getting stiff. Which is a pus filled dumpster fire streaming server. Why is everyone suddenly so. Does everyone think they're like a noir detective narrating the opening of a movie? <laughs> what a wretched fucking hive of pus and misery. This is like what everyone goes for. Like, everyone's a noir when they want to describe something they don't like. It was a cold and rainy night, and I was on Twitch. What a, what a hive so. De land of debauchery. Damn it all. Testing if Twitch could censor my text if insulted it, but you thought it was going to? People insult Twitch all the time. I insult Twitch. I just thought it was like amusing how you had such a noirish take on it. Who shot me? Another turret. Yeah, another fucking turret. But I come around here, I got overcharge mode on. At least now I do. turrets, huh? This is not two turrets in this dead-ass room with nothing in it. Thank you. The number of that code? Uh, no, that's just actually a light. Yeah, I feel like this is the robot level. Not so many of the mutants here. I desperately need to find the recycling device. I've got too much shit. It's just saw the title and like that's a line from the game. Well, not the it's like look at you, hacker. I just he adapted it. Oh, this is this room. Is this important?
This looks a little important to me. Well, maybe it's not. All right, continue looking through the maze. Nice shooting text. Oh, fuck. I just realized it is almost midnight. I was actually enjoying this enough that I was not paying attention to the time chat. Another streamer on your tab that I forgot until just now. For some reason, I thought there was weird background music in the game. <laughs> so they were just playing music and you didn't, they didn't have a voice going? Far behind my house is playing Final Fantasy piano and guitar and very ethereal background music for this. That sounds like a good thing. You know what? Usually you don't like it when you hear like outside noise in your place, but if there was like a good like music soundtrack like that, I'd be down. Hmm. Something tells me that skeleton is like, you know, like don't go down there. <laughs> I mean, I feel like we can do this. What kind instant? Based on the fact that these skeletons have been degloved of all flesh, that's probably not good for your health. Oh fuck, oh fuck, it's too hot, it's too hot to jump! Oh, oh, toasted my ass when I got out. Luckily this character is not as thick as me. This way, then. Nuts roasted, ass roasted. If we're being scientific, my die. I've never been. This didn't really lead me to anything, though. Or did it? Yeah, I think I've yeah, I think I've been shit. Alright, so where are we gotta go? Uh we explored this all up here. I guess we head down here now. Really wanted to make your own uh, chichar chicharans? What's a chicharan? Filling something over here in my kill mate. Spanish pork rinds. Mm, I'm not a fan of pork rinds, to be perfectly honest with you. Then again, I've never, I guess I never had proper pork rinds. If there is such a thing. So we can continue going to here, but let's check in this room. You know, what's a little, like, stage four lymphoma? Energy projectile shield absorbs a minor amount of damage from projectiles and energy beams at an expensive energy. Oh, 
Hope you all have a good night. Hope you have a great night too, man. Thanks for being here. When is the PS4 version that's coming? I imagine eventually it will. Kind of, I can't see a reason why it wouldn't. So uh, it is a. It, I'm, I'm assuming you can make this work in a controller, despite it you know, being a fiddly controlling game. Yeah, there's no reason why not. But I don't know if it's coming anytime soon, though. PC was their main objective. Uh, negotiations can you go well with the United Earth Miners conglomerates <coughs> or rights to Saturn's moons? Proctoman is uniquely positioned to make a deal since Citadel Station is already in a stable orbit and has the scientific equipment necessary to preliminary surveys. Profit projections assuming a 30% stake in UEM's local mining activities and standard rate are promising. Our lawyers are researching the legality of imposing a 25% shipping tax since Triotoman technically has first rights space shipping lanes in the Saturn sector. What am I playing on? I'm playing on PC. I use my PS4 for a majority of the time. I love that. I mean, it was a good system. I'll give it that. But when you want to stream, primarily you use a PC. It's just more handy. Unless it's like a con unless it's like an exclusive, I'll always almost certainly. Or it just doesn't run well on PC. I'll always like gravitate toward that. Alright. <laughs> that door's locked. Mm hmm. Which means we go over here and try this door. Early 90s ass level design, by the way. Not a fan of it. What was the point of that? Do you play Street Fighter? Street Fighter 6 just came out recently. I'm not really a fighting game guy, but I probably will be playing Street Fighter 6 because I might be able to make a video on it. If it has a decent enough story mode like Street Fighter V did. What is the purpose of this room? Uh, robot production. Team robot production must be shut down during a station-wide power fluctuation to ensure the robots on the line aren't defective. Free art your training. If the production systems are shut off improperly or restored without an official inspection, defective units have a higher chance of making it through. Management does not want further damage to personal, personnel or systems due to poor blind quality. As a reminder, the production shutdown code is 811. This time, I will address this matter. I just... Again, puts me in a room I've been in. Oh, hello, little guy. You have USBs in your glove? Look, it's a hacking glove. You, you, of course you're going to have USB slots. I'm a cyborg, man. This map isn't nearly as big as the previous one, but I have no idea where to go. However, it is kind of late. I'm thinking of ending it now. Because it is actually past midnight. And I... Yeah. So, <clears throat> chat, do you feel like ending it there? I might play this game again tomorrow. Could go back to Zelda. But I'll be streaming something. But you guys seem like you enjoy that. So, yeah, we'll continue playing this. Ah, look at these arms stretch. <laughs> Had them in gamer position for too long. Chat, you've all been great tonight. Thank you for joining me. Loved every minute of it, even. Oh, uh, talk with you. All the talks were good. We talked. You guys are a great conversation. Thank you very much for joining me. Um, so, I'll be streaming again tomorrow. If you guys want to stop by, I'd love to have you. If you're new here, hit the follow button. And you can also join my Discord. Good place is all. 
But thank you for any bit subs or gift subs on it as well. Much appreciated. Thank you, the mod team. Thanks for each and individual, all you people who stopped by. Love ya. So, I am going to log off now. Um, you guys have a great night. Way to go, smart dart. Thank you. All right, chat. You guys enjoy the rest of your evening. See you tomorrow. Peace.